now, here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, despite the chance of an early morning shower or thunderstorm tomorrow, better part of Wednesday is actually sunny and dry. Take a look down along the south shore with the high humidity levels and a southerly breeze. It's usually get these stratus clouds, these low clouds that are starting to come in off the ocean. And then while we still have some breaks in them, you can still see some splashes of sunshine. These low clouds will tend to fill in and advance to the north. These are not producing any precipitation. We don't expect any showers until after midnight, but the dew points remain high, especially along the south shore. So when you take very humid air and you pass it over a relatively cooler surface like the ocean, it condenses into those low clouds. And that's why you're seeing some of that in places uh, like like Newport. When we take a look at the dew point of the muggy meter, which is very high right now. Look at the huge drop in the dew point later tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. This extends all the way through Saturday. So we get into some very ultra comfortable air starting uh, tomorrow evening before those dew points, before that humidity starts to spike again by Sunday over the holiday weekend. Temperatures now in the low 80s after reaching 88 in Providence, 81 mid to upper 70s right now along the coastline that breeze off the water, keeping it a little cooler threat tracker overall is green next several days. The, the one thing that we'll watch though very early in the morning for some uh, showers and perhaps an isolated rumble of thunder, but this is quick moving it, by eight, nine o'clock in the morning. It's gone. The sun is back out by 10 uh, and the rest of the day is fine and it sets up for some beautiful weather on Thursday as well. You can clearly see the showers and thunderstorms in the Hudson Valley of New York. This is ahead of a cold front right in here. So as the front approaches overnight while we're sleeping, some showers, scattered thunder, extending into about 6, 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. Behind the front, this is where the drier air is located, the lower humidity and very refreshing. So it does start off humid in the morning and then it starts to drop off during the afternoon and evening. Let's get you in close, take you through the evening. You see the low clouds uh, streaming in and then after midnight showers. And then here we are 5, 6, 7 o'clock in the morning with a fast moving line of showers, maybe a quick downpour or a thunderstorm. But watch how rapidly that pulls away by 9 o'clock in the morning, certainly by 10 a.m. We're back to sunshine and dry and it's a warm day tomorrow afternoon with plenty of sun up to 85. But each passing hour, the humidity is dropping off, so it's not as muggy the second half of the day and especially by tomorrow evening, tomorrow night, refreshing air, good, well, comfortable sleeping weather by 11 o'clock tomorrow night in the lower to middle 60s. So anything around daybreak should be ending, um, you know, by 7, 8 o'clock in the morning, 9 o'clock, it's gone, 10, 11 o'clock in the morning, the sun is back out, 81 degrees at 11 a.m. And during the afternoon, real nice day, sunshine, warm. I mean, the average high is 80. We're, we're forecasting 85, so a little above average. Bay forecast bonus, the one thing to be mindful of is obviously that thin line of showers and thunder that comes through around 6, 7 a.m. It is gone by 8, 9 a.m. Southerly breeze for a couple of hours, but it's generally a west wind uh, tomorrow afternoon, 5 to 10 knots. Actually, the beaches look pretty good once you get beyond, say, 9 o'clock in the morning, increasing sunshine air temperature in the lower 80s. Comfortable Thursday, beautiful Friday, nice on Saturday. Sunday's not too bad. There may be a shower Sunday evening, Sunday day looking okay. Still some question marks on Monday, Labor Day. Check back with us. We're going with some extra clouds and a slight chance of a shower. Temperature at about uh, 78 degrees, but it should be gone the rain by around 9 a.m. tomorrow. All right, Tony, thank yeah. you. Coming up tonight at 10 and 11, 